Knowledge and Love for the Blessed Virgin Mary Saturday is a day in which we dedicate to the Blessed Virgin Mary. Our Lord from the cross spoke seven words. It's called his seven last words. Can you mention the seven times that Mary spoke in the Bible? Let's see. The first time we have Mary speaking is in the Annunciation, when the Archangel Gabriel announces to her that she's going to be the Mother of God. She says, How can this happen, since I do not know man? Because Mary had made a vow of virginity. She could not coincide her virginity with having a child. And it was explained to her that she conceived through the power of the Holy Spirit. Then once she understands, her second word is in the context of the Annunciation, where Mary says, Behold, I am the handmaid of the Lord, be it done to me according to thy word. So the first two would be in the context of the Annunciation. The third word of Mary is she goes to visit Elizabeth and she greets Elizabeth. Exactly what was the greeting we don't know, but it could have been the typical way that the Jewish people would greet each other. That would be using the word Shalom. And Shalom means peace be with you. The fourth time Mary speaks is still in the context of the visitation and is the longest verbal expression that Mary has, and it is her Magnificat. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. Fifth time Mary speaks is when Jesus is lost and found in the temple. She says, Son, why have you done to this? Behold how your father and I have been searching for you in sorrow. Then the sixth time that Mary speaks is in John chapter 2 in the context of the wedding feast of Cana. They run out of wine and Mary turns to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and says, There is no wine. Then the last time that Mary we have Mary's words recorded in the Bible are again in the context of the wedding feast of Cana, John chapter 2, 1 to 12, which is also the second luminous mystery. And Mary gives the best advice in the world. Mary says, do whatever he tells you. What wonderful advice. Do whatever he tells you. If we would just do whatever Jesus told us, we'd all be living a happy life, a joyful life, a peaceful life. We'd all be on the highway to heaven. So why don't you try to meditate upon the seven words of the Blessed Virgin Mary that are recorded in the Bible, the Word of God.